Hey everyone, I'm Ultima456, you're the Ultimates, and welcome to episode 32 of Less Platinum Resident Evil 8 Village. Alright, let's open. As soon as that happens, we can skip. Move over here. Press the X button. As soon as that happens, we can skip. Now we gotta beat this guy, so make sure you get your knife. And one or two slashes. Oh, okay. Yeah, there we go. We got him. Alright, good. I actually took a little bit longer than I expected to take him down. Uh, oh no, I need the bolt cutters. Uh, so where were they? There's like chem fluid, herb. Ah, it's inside, that's right. Behind the curtain. So yeah, it's been a little while since I... How do you turn? Okay. <laughs> it's been a... Uh, I think the last, the, I only did one practice for the, the knife only run and it was like months ago when I was preparing everything, but uh, it should be alright. Alright, so we get close to this, and then nothing, and we've got to run upstairs, you just got to know all the trigger points, we got to cut the thing breaking, climb upstairs small, grab this, get scared, okay, so now some of these guys will come. Uh, where is it? Yeah, we'll just hold this. We need to fight one. Try to make sure to pick up everything you can for extra money. That's, that's what I want. So, the other thing I forgot to mention... Hang on a sec. Yeah, okay, we just need to kill that one. The other thing I forgot to mention was that, um... Nice. You cannot Over. use more than, I think it's four recovery items, and you cannot purchase um, more than 10,000, uh, like use more than 10,000 lay. Um, and obviously beat it under three hours, all that kind of stuff. So I'm going to try and do this as well as I possibly can. Damn it. Uh, we don't need that. Go over here, send the bag of flour, this one. No, I was supposed to jump down. May have said that that, was, that that other ladder was the only one you could jump down. I forgot about this one. Rusted scrap. Let's pop that over there. Rusted scrap. You don't need to go for all these things that I'm going for, but I'm just doing it. Okay, nice crystal skull. I think you can't go. Oh, you can. Couldn't remember if you could go this way or not. Now we go here. Ah, get inside. Close the door. Break, hold. Ah, there was someone there. Oh no, there wasn't. Nice. So this is a really weird section. It's got like a trigger point. You have to wait for Ethan to say certain things. Like there's too many of them or something like that. Yeah, there's no end to them. So just do your best to survive. Try and take a few out. Blocking is important. Nice. Oh, that was very good. Damn. The good thing is that even though you can only heal a maximum of like four times for the for the trophies and stuff, um, you do get full heals throughout the playthrough sometimes. So let's go over here now. Just trying to go for the slash there. Yeah. Now there's another trophy concerned with this area where you have to defeat. Um, ooh, that's very low on health, but it's okay. You have to defeat uh, Urius, who's like the big lichen that turns up at the end. But there's no... It, it's like quite difficult to do. Even on casual. Alright, I think we're almost done. Urius is turning up. There he is. I'm trying to figure out which way to go here. Just 
kind of block that. Come on, run. Oh, right, I've got to unlock it. That's a problem, actually. Okay, got through. Nice. Let me go unlock that real quick. Ah! Yeah, okay, getting very low on health. <laughs> Quickly. Okay, nice. Okay, I think we're almost done. I just gotta get back to the... near the doorway and we're good. Please shoot me! I'm supposed to get, like, pierced by an arrow or something. Stupid section. Oh, crap. <laughs> On. Oh no. <laughs> oh, damn cutscene, there we go, finally. <laughs> uh, skip. Alright, so I managed to get that. That took a little while, but we managed to get survive. Uh, I need to know health. Okay, my health is still okay, despite all that. Yeah, that bit is weird, it takes a long time. Okay. <clears throat> so that's Miranda there. Uh, we could go into the thing on the right, but screw it. I'm just going to try and collect everything that I can remember. One interesting thing is you can actually... Um, so, for example, there's a... Uh, hang on a sec. Shortcut this. You can still shoot down treasures. Like, I'll just show you. Hang on. So, challenges. Okay. You've completed the following challenges. Uh, completion point CP can be used to purchase items in the extra content shop in the bonuses menu. I've got Slayer. Let's find out what Slayer is. Um, it's probably like killing a certain amount of en enemies. Uh, defeat 300 enemies in the story. So I, yeah, just got up to 300 now. Uh, now, if we go to Knives Out, which is the, yeah. Finish the story using nothing but close combat weapons, not including the self-propelled artillery against Heisenberg or when prompted to shoot in the final battle against Miranda. But you can also shoot these and it won't it'll still say zero so as long as you don't shoot an enemy it, it won't uh, it'll count so that's pretty cool uh i think there's an herb here or something whatever um okay so we need to get the maiden crest which is here and then we need to go to louisa's house which is up here <clears throat> now I'm purposely not healing because I'm pretty confident I can't quite remember when it is, but pretty confident there's a uh, a free heal spot coming up. It is also possible to get through this area without alerting the lichens, as I just demonstrated by going all the way around. Now we get the cutscene. Yeah, that first part with the lichens takes the longest amount of time. 130 lay. Yes, yeah, got the gunpowder, nice. I think there was something in here. Chem fluid, may as well. Uh, okay, let's open the door. Skip. Try and open the door. Skip. Inside. Alright, now for here, you have to like read this, turn the page, until you hear like the door opening. I'm gonna back out now. Walk around, there we go, the door opens. You can get around her, but unfortunately you can't start the cutscene until she's here. Push me, push me. <laughs> okay, that's still pretty good. Now we can skip. Oh, whoop. I don't think that counted. <laughs> I didn't shoot him. Uh, let me just double check that. Yeah, okay, cool. Oh boy, alright, be careful there. Um, is there anything here? No. There's like an herb here. Um, there's something... It's like lay in one of these. The note. This is the thing we need. Truck key. Examine to get the screwdriver. And then there's one more thing over here. 
Shotgun shells. I think that's it, yeah. Might be something else I missed. Nope. Okay, that's it. Damn, the fire's moving fast. Okay, start engine with the truck key. Alright, so I'm still on pretty low health. But very soon. Hit the gas. Don't worry. And try not to breathe in the smoke. I feel like it's here. I know. Thank you, Ethan. I think this one, if you run past her, you can start the cutscene earlier. Yeah, there you go. Uh, let me run over here. I just I don't get it. Climb through and jump down. Okay, still nothing yet, but that's okay. There's a section. Oh, that's right. Uh, here, screwdriver. I was like trying to think of like where is the the bit where you get your health back. It'll come up eventually. Okay, Yulian dies. To Miranda. That's the first part of me, Miranda. The, uh, yeah, I forgot to talk about it. The section at the end, uh, with Rose. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, oh, there's no cuts in here. Is very interesting because, um, it seems like <laughs> from, uh, like what people have said. Guess this leads to the castle. It feels like, you know, okay, so she's a baby here in, like, present day. But then all of a sudden she's, like, what, around 18, right? At the... In that... In that post credit scene. So, your natural instinct Nothing is to go... Huh? To go, well, 18 years must have passed, you know? But it feels like, or at least the consensus, I think, amongst the community is that that's not actually the case. Um, the fact that she was... Um, what? such a big baby when she was born, like she was huge. The man is of no real use to anyone else. And on top of that, my daughters do just give me a sec here, trying to wait for this to skip, be skippable. Oh, it's going to be loud as well. Yeah, it should be fine. And the other thing is that like, she's so big and she's powerful, so it feels like there's a chance that she's rapidly like aging. So, that scene at the end might only be like a couple of years after, um, after the events of this game. So that's pretty interesting as well. I have no idea who the person is that, um, turns up at the end there. Okay, let's do this. So now it's time for the beautiful, blood-soaked grand finale. <laughs> Nothing like fresh American ground beef. <laughs> All right, cool. We got through that. Yeah, the guy at the end who turns up like Wait, near the car. Freaks have rose. It's pretty much impossible to tell who it is, but it's likely going to be like Chris or Leon or... Well, maybe not Chris, but yeah, maybe it'll be Leon or some character that we know. I don't know. We have very little to go on for as to what they're going to do with the next game. It feels like you, we're going to be playing as Rose, but in terms of um, exactly what the game's going to look like, what the game's going to be about, that's going to be different. Yeah, I thought I saw something pick up over there. Okay, so back to the knife. Did I... Okay, there we go. See, I got a full heal. I didn't use a health item and I got a full heal. It was like an herb here, wasn't there? On the next one. Link. Yeah, you definitely want to make sure that you pick up like as many things as you can if you if you remember. Alright, now here's an important section. Do not, I repeat, do not buy anything from... Welcome from the Duke. I'm just going to quickly show off what he's got. Has arrived for you, good so sir. he's got, what is this? Uh, you can buy Magnum ammo now, as well as um, rifle ammo, which we saw before. And you can buy a bunch of different um, customizable parts for the different weapons that you're going to, that we got. So what is it? The V16, uh, two items for the V16, two items for the SYG12. WCX and the stake as well. 
So ah yes, I have you. Lots of Find some quality oh, ingredients and bring them to me. Okay, you don't Finished. bother selling anything. Are you sure you have everything? All right, let's go. How much time? We've got five minutes left. All right, I do like the the castle. Oh, nope, thought that was a cutscene. The castle. Um, okay, I did actually ride down. Rose, be here. I'm gonna quickly just grab this one. I always like to try and get at least these things if they're, you know, not too far out of my way. Uh, yeah, that's fine. Skip that one because we can't open it. Uh, that's fine as well. Go through here. All right, in order to actually progress, you need to go right here. There you have to wait for the screen to take place. Now you get a cutscene. Now we do the arm thing, or the hand thing, I should say. I wish we could skip this. <laughs> um, Alright, let me see if I can read my little guide here, just to... Uh, open the door to the right of the main hall. Wait, I'm so confused. <laughs> Alright, you get another full heal here as well. Oh, I see. Yeah, yeah. Okay. <laughs> I'm gonna try this and hopefully it'll work. Alright, so... Oh, wait, wait. Get the, uh... Get the crimson glass, because it sells for a little bit. Is there something on the chair there? Hang on. No. Okay, my imagination. Okay, so now that you go there, open the uh, little fireplace here. Games I reckon would be pretty fun to speedrun. I know a lot of the speedrunners have already discovered like so many things about this game. Is there anything for this one? Oh. Alright, we need the. Well, we don't need that. Rusted scrap. We need this though. The maroon eye ring. And we may as well go to craft uh, key items and get the maroon eye straight out of it. Now we squeeze through. No. Can look, pick it up. Where have they taken okay, so here's something that you don't need to do, but if you do it, it actually helps a little bit. If you go to the right, just unlock that door. It'll be useful for for later. All right, so let's see. So we go there. I tried to write down like where I was supposed to go. So immediately you need to use the maroon eye. I just quickly smash this for for some money. Um, okay, that one in the way. Okay, so now we have this cutscene. <laughs> I haven't cut open a man and then we have in a to while. Turn and go this way. Let me string you up, slice your jugular, and just watch. Taking a live go dead, here. which would you prefer? Pull that off. And straight down. You will look wonderful There's literally nothing to collect in, in that section, so don't worry. Um, okay. Now we climb through here. Uh, <laughs> I wrote, um, use the maroon eye to initiate cutscene with one of the daughters, run away and land in the dungeon. Simply follow... Hang on a sec. There you are. Or is it simply follow? I lost my place. I'll do it now. Hang on. Uh, yeah, there's this. I oh. will just shoot this because it saves time. There we go. While this opens, uh, simply follow the path and end up defeating the first order. <laughs> Let's see how true that was. <laughs> oh yeah, it should be pretty true because this is just running through the. Uh, I thought that was something there. Alright, so we are going to have to fight these, uh... Oh, hello. Oh, we don't have to. Actually, defeating them might not be the worst idea in the world, because... Pipe bomb. Nice. Because they won't do too much damage. And you can get, uh, Louise's necklace from them. 
So the the actual this Karambit knife it's one of these that has the necklace. The Karambit knife seems to have like a multiple hit kind of thing on it. There it is. In oh, not the Weezers, Ingles. Okay, run, run, run. Oh, wait. Good. Where's the other money? Just keep circling around. 5.30. Open. Good. It's a little bit of lay, but... It adds up. Alright, I'm gonna skip that. Um, yeah, Ingrid's necklace, not Louise's. Uh, the Karen bit knife seems to have, like, multiple hit, um... How can I put it? I like, multiple frames. Caused all this mess. Multiple frames where you can hit the enemy. Shotgun ammo, spin... Ah, I was right, because now we have to fight. Um... Your tonight's main okay, so skip this. Now just, like... <laughs> Be careful. <laughs> this can't be. And she's pretty much dead now. There we go. Oh, baby. And gun ammo. She did hit me once, but that's okay. And gun ammo. I cannot progress. So just keep picking up stuff. Uh, oh, I'm out of time. All right. Get the Sanguinous Virginis. Cool. Break this, shotgun ammo, anything here, rusted scrap, get the wooden angel if you have a lockpick, which, ooh, 10,000 lay. Uh, that was originally an upgrade for the Lemmy, and so now in its place is a um, is 10,000 lay, which is really good. So make sure you pick that up. Wooden angel statue. Okay, I'm going to leave things here and we'll continue next time. For now, I want to thank you all for watching episode 32 of Let's Platinum Resident Evil 8 Village. My name is Ultima456. You're the Ultimates. And I'll see you next time.